Have you ever wondered which is the best setting in the NVIDIA control panel for thread optimization? Is it auto, is it off, or is it on? Well, in today's video, that's exactly what I'm testing. So sit down, strap in, let's go. Right guys, in today's video, I'm gonna be having a look at thread optimization in the NVIDIA control panel. So once you open up here and you go to manage 3D settings, and you just scroll down, you get thread optimization. So in this little box, you've got auto, off, and on. These are the settings that I'm going to be testing today. And guys, just by the way, this is going to be my last video control panel or video for quite some time. Um, I'm going to be doing a full GPU optimization video towards the end of the week because there's updated information from the last time I did it, about eight or nine months ago. So I'm going to be done with video control panel for a while. But before I get to my results, guys, Please head on over to my homepage, on my, on my YouTube homepage. If you are subscribed to the channel, please just make sure that notifications are set to all. And then like the video, comment on the video, and share the video. Really will help me with the algorithm. Thanks, guys. I'm getting close to 3,000 3, subscribers. You guys are all rock stars. And then to those of you that aren't subscribed, please consider subscribing if you find this content helpful by the end of the video. And then I have a whole bunch of optimization videos on my homepage. You can go through that. Full CPU optimization. This is how to unlock undervolting for 10 gen and newer step one and two. And then uh, for older generations, yeah, it's how to unlock undervolting. But let's get to those results, guys. So as mentioned in the NVIDIA control panel, I'm testing thread optimization. Guys, just bear in mind, I test um, all my games in medium settings. They're all single player. Um, they're all medium settings except for the newer games uh, because I do test on a GTX 1650 laptop So the last of us Remnant 2 all the new games are tested at low settings FSR 2.0 2.1 I use a quality setting where available as mentioned I do test on a GTX laptop So if you're an RTX card your results may vary. I did this test last week So I was using Nvidia 546.01 for my test. So let's get to those results so, in the NVIDIA control panel, when I set thread optimization to auto, um, when I, I think I tested, ooh, five to nine, so I tested 16 games. Over those 16 games on auto, I add up all the average FPS and I get to 939. When I add up all the 1% lows, I get to 723 over those 16 games. And then when I add up all the 0.1% the lows, I get to 630. Then when I set the thread optimization to off, um, I add up all the average FPS, get to 935. So you can see slight little drop in average FPS, but not that much. I mean, this is over 16 games. Then I add up all the 1% lows and I get to 712. So this is where setting thread optimization offers a liability in terms of the 1% lows. Yeah, you can see it's a drop of over 10 FPS over 16 games. And then when I add up all the 0.1% lows, you can see uh, it's quite a bit lower than setting it to auto as well, because there the 0.1% lows are 630, you add 610. Then for my last setting, I set thread optimization to on, and then over those 16 games, when I add up all the average FPS, I get to 938. So you can see um, it's pretty much on par with setting it to auto, one FPS less. Then when I add up all the 1% lows, I get to 723, exactly the same as when I set it to auto, um, much better than when I set it to off. And then when I add up all the 0.1% lows, I get to 640. So. Uh, in threaded optimization, the best setting is either auto or on, but if you set it to on, your 0.1% lows are fractionally higher than with auto. So guys, if one more recommendation in the NVIDIA control panel, threaded optimization, don't use auto, don't use off, put it on, on. Because you're going to see the average FPS is pretty much the same as uh, setting it to auto when you set it to on. The 1% lows are exactly the same. But the place where you do get a benefit is the 0.1% lows, a little bit higher on when you set it to on as opposed to auto. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to smash that like button. If you have any questions, 
please hit me up in the comment section and then guys as always if you're still watching and you haven't subscribed as of yet now's the time to do so guys it's almost friday have a good one there's people like you 